Well, it's not as far-fetched as it may seem. Hello everyone, it's Kay. Again, again. Today I thought I would film the not requested college dorm room haul. I'm going to be moving to college in about a week or so, so I honestly need to make sure I have everything I need. And this video honestly is more for me to determine like what I actually need and what I don't have. So when I go to college, I don't second guess anything and everything can move smoothly because Corona season has already derailed college for me, so we don't want anything else to completely take me off course when I get to my school. <laughs> so the first thing I got was this backpack. I got this off of Amazon and I absolutely love this backpack. I've had it for a few days and I really like how small and lightweight this is. It's really easy to carry around. It doesn't carry too much. And since I'm gonna be going to college, I'm not gonna really need as much school supplies as I was gonna need when I was in high school. Like literally I take like two to three classes, like three being a lot, like three is like a lot. Usually I have like two classes a day. So I really like the fact that I don't have to go to class and carry all my books and stuff every single day. Cause trust me, that gets super tiring after a while. It has a really nice pocket for your laptop. So you don't always have to put that in the main compartment and it has another compartment just to put your notebooks your folders and anything in that sort in there as well and then it has that classic lunchbox pocket that we all know and love from elementary school where you would put your lunchbox in here but i ain't an elementary school student anymore honestly i don't even know what i'm gonna be putting in here probably just extra things that are just gonna be lying around in my dorm and then the next part is just another small little compartment this is like where you can put like your phone and your wallet and stuff in here which is pretty useful because i'm not gonna be able to carry my little man purse around with me everywhere so this is an absolute essential for sure it also has two side pockets right here which i actually really like extra compartments is like my favorite thing because i literally carry so much stuff in my backpack you guys don't even know like it's just something I have to have. And I really like this backpack because of the multiple compartments, but also how small it is. And the vintage theme behind this backpack was really nice and I absolutely love it. So this backpack is definitely a must have if you're going to college. I really like this bag. And trust me, when you want to not carry so much in your bag, try to get a small bag if you can. If you have to get a large bag, at least try not to carry everything in it because trust me, it's just, oof. You don't want a big bag, trust me. The next one, the next one. Next thing I have in here is this tea kettle that I got also off of Amazon. Ha uh ha. -huh. Is Amazon sponsoring this video? Anyways. <laughs> This kettle is actually really nice. I love it. I haven't actually opened it yet, but it's one of those electric kettles, so you don't have to like pour it over a stove and let it like heat the water or anything. It's electric, you just plug it into your wall, press a little key and it just boils itself, which is pretty useful because I am a slob and I don't like to do anything. So if anything can make itself easier for me, yes, let's get this, please. Honestly, I need actual help. Whew. I literally have two 8 a.m.s, so there's no way I'm gonna be realistically going to the dining hall every single morning. So having this and my oatmeal is literally gonna be sweet heaven. I also got this shoe caddy, which is also from Amazon. Um, I've had one of these in my other room before and this is literally a must have because I really wanna take all my shoes to college and it will not be possible in these small arrangements of the closet. So this is actually really nice. I really love this shoe caddy. It can hold literally, I think it can hold, yeah, 24 shoes. That's like insane, so. And then the rest of the stuff I got is from Hobby Lobby. This also has some school supplies that I'm bringing, but like, I was so lazy this year that I literally just did not bring anything. I'm literally reusing a lot of stuff. The first thing I got were a few throw pillows. This is this cute little bird pillow. It's so 
you. Oh my goodness, I can see myself just sleeping like a log on this thing. It's super decorative, so it makes my room shine bright. And yeah, it's so cute. Look at its little eyes. So I are so cute. And the next thing is also another throw pillow because I like to make things a little bit decorative, even though that I literally could have been more decorative, but you boys on a budget. This is a cute little pillow. Honestly, I love this so much. It's supposed to be like a baby hippo. It's so cute. Like, it's just so cute. Hobby Lobby had the cutest stuff, but Hobby Lobby was also expensive. Oof, it was so expensive. The another thing that I got is an oil diffuser. I actually love this oil diffuser. We had one in our house the other day before it like broke down and it was so nice. It color changing, which is nice. And I actually love this because I don't want to always have to be spraying like air freshener in my room. And I see them all over college door palms and everyone loves the smell of them. It like makes you fall asleep with all the essential oils just fill up the entire room. So I thought I would get one. It was pretty expensive though, it was like $30. So, yeah, and I talked to my parents about it and they were like, yeah, you can't get any less than $30 for a day. So, I got one of these. It's so cute. It's, ooh, ooh, I'm excited to use it. Now, moving into the school supply section of my dorm, I literally got like absolutely nothing because I'm such a lazy slug. So I got these mechanical pencils. They come in a pack of three. And I really love pencils that come with lead and erasers because that means I'm gonna be less likely to buy more pencils in the future, which that's gonna save me that coin. It has three different pencils, different colors, and overall, what I have here is these Kukuyu Campus Soft Hand. I saw these on Pinterest and on a YouTuber named Study Quill. She uses these notebooks so much. She says they're like the best notebooks to write on. They have really good paper. They're very thick, but it's also really smooth and it's really good to be taking notes in. It's also dotted, so it gives you a lot more range in terms of how you can take your notes. So I thought that these notebooks were a must have and an essential. So I'm gonna try them out and see how they do. They come in a pack of five, so hopefully I won't have to be buying any more notebooks this year, which I've had to do in years past. <laughs> getting is a little small roll of tape actually tape has kind of been handy for me if i'm being completely honest because sometimes i would need to like tape something or put something back together and i don't have tape and it literally bugs me so much so i was like no hide it you are getting tape like this is not gonna happen you're getting tape i got washi tape <laughs> washi tape it came in a pack of three. I got one in silver. I got this gold hexagonal shape. And then I got one that's kind of just lined and striped and it was in navy blue. This is so cute. This is what I actually used to decorate that notebook and a few of my other supplies and in my bullet journal. So yeah, I'm like so excited. Folders. I got a ton of folders because I like to organize my stuff in folders. Binders are just too big and Ooh, like, I, 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 I can't use binders, you guys. I can't do it. So, I have these folders. They're from Mead. I got a couple durable ones just for, like, classes that I know that I don't have a lot of papers and a lot of work. So, especially, like, one of my classes, it's going to be basically a two-hour lecture once a week. So, this is an essential. I also got this one that has some dolphins, and it was kind of really hungry, and... This one is so cute. I like this glittery dolphin holder. It's just the best and it was so cute. I also got a scented folder. This also was from, this stuff was all from Walmart by the way. This scented folder was really nice. All you have to do is scratch it and smell it and it smells like watermelon. Is that not the cutest thing ever? And it was literally only like 99 cents. So yes. And I also got this puppy dog folder cause why not? I got these Pilot G2 pens because in college you are always taking notes. As you can see, I literally already opened these because I've already started using them. Hashtag don't do that because you literally are going to run out of ink and I didn't buy ink. So these pens are really nice. They are supposedly supposed to be known as the longest writing pens. 
We're gonna see that theory if it's true because every time I have a black pen, it literally dies in like a week. I also forgot to mention that I also have my Erin Condren Life Planner, which you guys might have seen in my Life Planner unboxing. So check that video out in the description. You also can get 20% off in my description below in that video. So you don't wanna miss that. And yeah, that's pretty much it for all the school supplies that I got and everything that I possibly need for the dorm because I'm going to college. That actually is just starting to hit me. Like, I'm gonna be attending college in a week and a half. That's literally scaring me. Like, wow. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you guys liked it, please like, subscribe, and comment below any more video ideas you guys have, and I will see y'all in another video.